What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to the show. So what I'm going to start doing, and I, I did this in a, in a previous video, and I got a, a really good response. So I want to look at the calendar. So look at, we're going to go back. We're going to go back to August. So I posted this calendar in August, and I said this is when these things are anticipated uh, to pass. And so we're going to take a look at that. And the reason that I want to do this is because it's important for us to really follow Congress and see, are they doing anything? And it, it, it's kind of hard because when you lose track of what's being talked about and how long it's taking for them to move forward, then once they pass something, then you're thinking, okay, well, they passed it only took a um, couple weeks, maybe. But when you start looking at things, you realize this is months, months ago. These things haven't been addressed for months. And when, when they get addressed, then you're like, okay, well, yeah, it didn't take that long. But when you look at it, you realize, wow, this is, this is ridiculous. We have Congress and they're just not doing anything. They're going on recess, they're coming back, they're arguing with each other, and then they're going back on recess. That's it. They're not passing any bills. And so what I wanna do in this video is I wanna show you guys this calendar that I posted several months ago, back in August, and let's see exactly what they got done. So let's give them a grade. But first off on this channel, we talk about money, news, and more. If that sounds like something interesting to you, please subscribe to the channel and hit that little bell notification. That way you'll get notified anytime we put out a video. And like always, if you see my name and a picture of me in the comment section, make sure you also see a check mark next to my name. That check mark signifies that it's me. If you do not see that check mark, it's not me. It's someone trying to impersonate me. Okay, so let's go ahead. I wanna show you guys this. Uh, and this is the illustration that I posted about uh, in August, so several months back. And it is, we're gonna go over it because it's it's gonna be pretty shocking when you look at this and you're gonna realize, wow, they haven't done anything. Uh, one thing I think they did in this, this whole uh, calendar that we had. So uh, back in August, 2021, uh, the Senate. Okay, so the Senate passed the first infrastructure bill. So we know that that got done. And we know the House was on recess at that time. The House got called back October 20 or August 23rd and they took up the bill. Now, they there was a promise there, okay? They, they extended the deadline, and so we had a promise that they were gonna take a look at this September 27th. That didn't happen, and so uh, we were looking at that first infrastructure bill. It didn't go anywhere. So in September, there was nothing, okay? So all this stuff here, we'll just cross it out here at this point. Or, actually, we don't have to cross this out because the Senate did something. They went ahead and passed the bill uh, but after that, they gave deadlines, and those deadlines went unanswered. And we continue to look at deadlines and, and recess and, and, and all this stuff, right? And so Social Security Administration, they did this. Okay, so we had the 5.9%, right? 5.9%, that was the COLA increase. And then we didn't know what was going to happen. We didn't know what was going to happen in November, and nothing happened in November. Well, I won't say nothing happened in November. So they did pass that first infrastructure bill, okay? So the first infrastructure bill did get uh, passed and it was signed off by the president. So that was, that was something good, something notable. But now we're looking at December. We don't know what's gonna happen in December. And we know that we have the debt ceiling. We know that we have the funding of the government, we know we have the NDAA, and we have the Build Back Better uh, plan. Those are the four major things that they need to take up in December. But if you're looking at this chart, not much has, has gone on, right? I mean, we had one thing that got passed, and then we found out about COLA, which we knew that that was already gonna happen. But uh, other than that, we're not looking at too much progress. We had the Senate, we'll say the Senate, yeah, they passed the first infrastructure bill. So when you're looking at this, three real significant things happen, but the reality is a lot of a lot of just pushing the can or kicking the can down the road. We saw a lot of that. And so uh, we do still anticipate COLA will start. We know that it's gonna be 5.9%, so January, that's when the first uh, increase uh, will be seen. But this is kind of sad when you think about it, right? Congress has kind of just been going back and forth, back and forth, not doing anything. And so when you start looking at these things, you realize you're paying their salary and they're making 174,000 plus per year and not much is being done, not much at all. 
And so, like I said, December, everything is pushed now to December. Will they get all this stuff done in December? I don't know. You look at this. You look at the stuff that they've gotten done in the last four months, and you tell me, will they be able to get all four things done in December? Probably not likely. So we're just gonna, we're gonna have to follow it and see where it goes. But I like to do videos like this because I wanna just show you that our, our government right now is not efficient. They're not working for the American people. And so because of that, we're, we're looking at stuff like this. Because of that, we're seeing our stock market just tank. Because of that, we're seeing a lot of the, the issues that we, don't, we shouldn't be, have to deal with. We're seeing, we're seeing those things happen because we just have Congress people that are just not working. They're not doing the things that they need to do for the American people. And this is, I'm, I'm not gonna say this is new, but this is on steroids. This is like, I have never seen our government function like this before. And you have, you have right now, you have Republicans that are just saying, we're not gonna play a role in these last two bills that they're trying to pass through. Well, no, the first infrastructure bill, you did have bipartisan support. You had some Republicans come on, on board. Now, I, I can't even remember how many it was, what, 15 or something like that that came on board, but, and, and we're talking about in the Senate, but you, the vast majority of Republicans didn't play a role when it came to the first infrastructure bill, and they're not playing a role when it comes to the reconciliation bill. That's why they're going through reconciliation, because you have no Republicans that want to support this, this uh, reconciliation bill, this Build Back Better bill. And so I, I, I have not seen our government like this. And this is not healthy, and this is not going to help us when it comes uh, down to things, because uh, we're, we're gonna continue to see this, because what's gonna happen is Democrats are gonna remember all the stuff that Republicans didn't wanna do, and then when Republicans come into power, Democrats are gonna do the same thing. And they're just gonna keep going back and forth, back and forth, and it'll get worse and worse and worse and worse, and it'll get to a point where nothing will get done. Not, I mean, we're seeing things right now where not much is getting done, but we're gonna get to a point where nothing will get done. Nothing at all, unless it's through reconciliation and they have to have those numbers. And if they don't have the 50 votes that they need in the Senate, then nothing will get done. And that's the reality. So that's what we're looking at. I mean, it's, it's unfortunate. And it, it's good that I, that I still have these illustrations because I can pull them up and just show you, hey, this is, we'll pull this up again in three, four months and we'll go over it again and we'll see. Did they get anything done in December? We'll have to see. Some things need to get done, or at least they need to kick the can down the road or continue resolution when it comes to the shutdown and all that, the government funding and all that. But the reality is they're not doing much. And right now they're grade. I don't know about you guys. You guys let me know, but I think that grade is an F. Uh, you guys let me know what you think. Or you know, I won't, I won't be that harsh. I won't be that harsh. I'm gonna say it's a D plus because they got a few things done. So we'll give them a D plus, but I wanna know what you guys think. What's your grade when it comes to our Congress, how they're handling things? Let me know down below. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe for more and I'll talk to you in the next one.